I'm a German recorder player and I've come to London um, about a year ago to study recorder at the Royal Academy. When I read about this, um, the information, I thought it sounded like a fantastic opportunity for a young musician to be offered the um, possibility to come up with three completely different programming ideas and then perform them in this um, prestigious venue. All the three concerts I'm doing are entirely different and the first one is called um, There is only one Bach and it might seem the most conventional but we're arranging it and fitting it for our own instruments so there will be um, pieces that I've arranged for recorder solo or just recorder and cello. The second concert I'm doing is called Cantata per Flauto and it's all about singing with the recorder or with any instrument. Um, so the pieces I will be playing with are all based on either songs or text or have some kind of relationship with singing or the human voice. And the last concert I'm doing, um, Points of Contact, is a lunchtime concert with recorder and percussion, which is very exciting for me because it's the first time I've been able to perform in this setup and we will be performing Renaissance and medieval music alongside contemporary music because in many ways it's very similar. The advantage is that everyone, or nearly everyone, has some kind of connection to the instrument because they played it when they were in school or they um, heard it in a concert somewhere. And I think that's an advantage, but this is also a challenge where we come in or I come in as a professional recorder player to talk about any prejudices there might be, any negative connotations, and replace them by um, just wonder and surprise and understanding of what the instrument can do. The best comment I can get after a concert uh, is someone saying, oh, I, I really didn't know the recorder could do this. <laughs> <laughs> 